when you have heard the news about Gilead's new drug, Remdesivir. It was one of the reasons they say that the stock market did so well on Friday, because people think we have a treatment now. So there is no actual data coming out from Gilead, it's just data from people who are using the drug. But I don't think it's a real game changer, actually. It doesn't even matter what data comes out. It is just not the game changer. So what it does is decreases the severity of the disease, meaning that if you get it, you're less likely to die. These people in the study from University of Chicago were very ill. Many of them were on ventilators. So yeah, it's wonderful that they could now maybe survive because we didn't have much else to offer before. But does it make a difference in terms of opening up the economy? The situation of the coronavirus pandemic? I would say no. Look, if a new antibiotic comes out, it doesn't make the news. We have had new antibiotics in the past few years, and some of them are absolutely amazing. The problem is very few people actually need it. That's why many companies that make antibiotics are going out of business. Because if you actually cure them, then you can't sell your product anymore. It's the whole Gillette disposable razor model. Many people need to hear, though, that's not an issue. It might change it and make it so instead of this disease with high mortality, it decreased the mortality. That'd be wonderful. But it doesn't mean people still won't mind getting this disease. You would still mind. You still have a high mortality. It's just not as high as before. It's not like getting the cold. It doesn't make it that way. Now, if you came out with an oral medication that you could take, that sort of prevents you from getting disease, that could be a game changer. Um, of course, the issue is then how compliant people are, because we didn't, all know nobody really likes taking medications every day if they don't have to. Like when I went to Africa, I was supposed to take my malaria pills or use good mosquito repellent, and I did sort of neither until the end of the month. I was like, oh, malaria? This is actually serious? Because, you know, you hear about people getting it. Another doctor had it. He was off for a little bit. And then I saw a lady in the ICU who was on a ventilator. And they said she had malaria. I was like, wow, that's, that's pretty serious. I should start taking my medication. You know, 25 days into my 30 days there. The idea of being a game changer means that you could reopen society, you don't worry about people being contagious, all this or that, and it's really going back to the idea of vaccination and testing to see if people have resistance. Vaccination, if you get enough people vaccinated, you think you could basically wipe out this disease. In terms of antibody testing, if enough people are immune, whatever that means, we still have yet to figure out. Um, that means that you can let these people walk freely because they sort of can't get it. It's sort of like how we know that certain people can't get AIDS right now, can't get HIV because they have a mutation. And actually a Chinese doctor, he's been recommended and, you know, had lots of things done to him since. But he decided, oh, this is a good thing. Let's, let, let me do this for children. So two babies he made immune to HIV. But it's all genetic editing and the world doesn't want that right now. And I don't think it's right anyways. But I think the idea is that, you know, this is not a game changer. It's a medication that's IV, it's given in the hospital, it's given to people that are very ill. It seems to have an effect on the preliminary non-published data, this word of mouth, shall we say. Even that's true, even it has a wonderful effect, it doesn't mean that you don't get sick from this disease. It just means if you get really sick, hopefully we could prevent you from dying. So my opinion, it's a wonderful medication. Hopefully it works. All the best to Gilead. But unfortunately, it's not going to change the game. It's not going to help the world in the sense that people are saying it does. In the sense that the stock market is saying that it will reopen the economy, I don't think so.